So this is what I'm trying to do here. I got the old line from the chandelier coming down and it was just coming right out of this beam with uh, no sort of box or anything and it did have a metal plate but that's about it. So I want to remove this wire and over here I had these two recessed lights that run off of a switch out here. Um, and what I want to do is get rid of these, uh, these lights here and I want to terminate that which I think I have good access to upstairs. Um, and I want to connect this. Uh, I want to connect another piece of Romex to that and run it over to here so then I have the chandelier on a switch um, because the old light fixture there just was a pull chain. Um, so that's that's what I want to accomplish in this room. Um, my problem is that I can't figure out where this wire is going to here. Um, and when I move it, um, Kathy uh, said she can feel upstairs a, uh, another piece of BX like that moving under the floorboard and I'll go upstairs and I'll show you where that is. The other weird thing is that um, I have juice to these now um, even when I fiddle with this this switch here if I turn it off or you know usually I just click it and turns it on and off but when I'm testing it with the uh, with the wingy it's uh, it's coming up like both of them are live uh, no matter what so I don't know what's going on with that either so I'll run upstairs real quick and I'll uh, I'll show you what I got going on up there <laughs> 